Okay, so first off, your teacher comes and writes on the board something like log base 3 of 9, and they ask you what it equals. When someone writes something on the board that you don't understand what it is, your first question should be, what does that mean? For example, the first time someone wrote on the board something like 4 cubed, you didn't just know what it meant for that little 3 power to be up top. You had to be told that this means 4 times 4 times 4. So the same question here, when this log is written, what does that even mean? So we want to figure out what it equals. We don't know what it equals yet. So I'm just going to write right now equals x. And we need to figure out what is x. Okay, so what does this mean? Well, what it means is 3 to the power of x equals 9. And then once you've got that written, all you need to do is figure out, okay, 3 to what power equals 9? And of course, the answer is 2. 3 to the second power equals 9. And then just to make it look nice, let's go back. What was x? x was log base 3 of 9. So apparently, log base 3 of 9 equals 2. So that's really just how logs work. Uh, you start out with the log, you write out what it means, and then sometimes you can do it in your head, sometimes you can't. Okay, so let's try another one here. So let's say we had log base 5 of 1. We want to know what this equals. So the first step is just write out equals x, since we don't know what it actually equals yet. Next, let's write out what does that mean. And what it means is the same thing as before. 5 to the power x equals 1. And then again, you need to ask yourself, 5 to what power equals 1? And you know the answer if you see my video, why does x to the 0 power equal 1? But it is, in fact, if you take to the 0 power, that equals 1. So log base 5 of 1 equals 0. And there we go. We did another log. Okay, so the two we've done so far, once you write out what it means, you can just look at it and see what the answer is. Uh, that isn't always going to be the case, so let's look at one like that real quickly. So let's say we had log base 2 of 3, and we want to know what this equals. So we start out by writing equals x. Next step, just as before, is write out what does this mean. And what it means is 2 to the power x equals 3. And then you have to ask yourself, 2 to what power equals 3? And the answer is, I don't know. right? We know that 2 to the 1 power is 2, and we know that 2 squared is 4. So 3 is somewhere in between those two, so I don't know what the answer is. We can't do it in our heads. So it's not always going to be the case that once you write out what the log means that you can just do it. But at that point, you'll either know, yes, I can do it in my head, or no, I would need a calculator to finish it up for me. So there's still more that goes on with logs, but hopefully that gets you the basic idea of what does it mean when they're writing log on the board. If you want to go more in depth on some other topics, I have uh, videos on natural log and rules of logs, and you can check those out as well. All right, so that's it for today. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave them in the comment section below, and I'll be sure to get to those. Thanks, everyone, and have a good one.